Hi, this is Chris Gould with Geeks on Tour. Did you recently receive an email from Google about Album Archive? It says, starting on July 19th, 2023, Album Archive will no longer be available. We recommend that you use Google Takeout to download a copy of your Album Archive data before then. What is Album Archive? It tells us that there's photos in there. I want to do two things in today's video. Number one is to assure you that any of your Google Photos are safe and the photos that are in your Blogger blog are safe in Blogger. There's no reason to be scared of this message. But number two, I will show you how to use Takeout to download the media from Album Archive before July 19, 2023. It can't hurt. So first I want to show you why I am not worried about my blogger photos. Here's the email I received and I just click here to go to Album Archive. Here's the message. Photos and videos you see here will no longer be available after July 19. What it should say is photos and videos you see here will no longer be viewable here. They are still available to your blog. Here I am at Album Archive and here is the album of photos from Blogger and my main blog and what I'm going to do now is show you that these same photos are available at a different interface, my blog. So I go to blogger.com and make sure I am on the blog, that my main blog, and you go to settings and then you scroll down a ways so you see manage blog and media from your blog. And you see here are the same albums. I click on Geeks on Tour and these are in a completely different sort order, but I have done enough spot checking to be confident that all the pictures that are in the album archive are here in the Blogger Media Manager. So, not to worry. It's still a good idea to follow the suggestions to download the album archive to your computer you, using Google Takeout. You just click the link to album archive from that email they sent. It's get.google.com album archive and as long as you're signed into your Google account you should be seeing any photos there. If you don't see any then you're you're good. I do have some so I'm going to click on go to takeout and it has already selected the album archive for me and I go to next step. Send the download, download link via email. That's fine with me. I just going to do this once and it suggests two gigabyte size of zip files. I don't think I have more than that. So create export. Google is creating a copy of files from Album Archive. This process can take a long time. You'll receive an email when your export is done. So that's all you have to do. You'll get an email when it's done and you can download the results. It is now ready. I will download those archive backup files. And it's just one file of less than two gigabytes, so that's nice. I am going to download that to my external heart, my backup drive. And make a folder for, and notice that it is a zip file. So it is now done. To unzip it, I right click and choose Extract All on, on Windows. And I'm going to extract in the same folder. 3,399 items. That will probably take a minute. So now, in addition to the zip file, I have the unzipped folder of contents. I open that and there's more folders below. 
and another. And here is actually all the contents. And the blogger is probably my where I have the most stuff. And these are folders for each blog that I have made. If I open one up, I'll see the photos that were in there. And then there's these JSONs. That is the metadata that goes along with the photo. So now you have a copy of the complete contents of the album archive on your computer's hard drive.